Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Christopher Ricker. I'm a New York City Parks environmental educator here in the Greenbelt. And today we're standing at High Rock Park on Nevada Avenue. And given current events, we want to provide virtual opportunities for all of you to enjoy nature, natural history, and our ecological community. And we're going to start today by introducing you to one of our native insects. This is known as a best bug. And even though we say best bug, it's a beetle. But beetles are still insects, and we know that because we have six legs that we can count here, as well as three body segments. The front part is the head, this middle section here is the thorax, and then the elongated part is the abdomen. So best bugs, unlike other beetles, actually live in small family units, or what we might call a colony. And the parents help to rear their young, so their little larvae, by providing food for them. Beyond providing food, best bugs can actually communicate with one another as well using acoustic sounds. So there's something like 14 different sounds that they make to communicate different things to one another. That is pretty unique in the animal kingdom, especially for invertebrates. And when I say invertebrates, I mean animals without backbones. So best bugs can be found throughout the green belt under rotting logs. They help as being biotic uh, decomposers. So they help to break down rotting wood and vegetation in our parks. So they kind of act like the sanitation workers of the green belt. And again, they're really shiny, really beautiful, and really unique amongst their invertebrate kin. So again, we want to thank you all for coming out and continuing to support the Green Belt, the Green Belt Conservancy, and New York City Parks. Again, during current events, given the circumstances, if you are going to visit our park, make sure that you're utilizing social distancing, spreading yourself out, and not congregating in high-use areas. And in doing so, you continue to support the beauty, health, and safety of all of our community members, both in the Green